and it's tuesday the 28th of february 2023 uh it's about 8 8 15 in the morning uk time this is on a personal note brief um as a few of you know i was in bermuda recently and i came back i developed covid again the first time i got covid in november 2021 it was delta and it i thought i was dying i really did for a couple of days I truly thought I was dying and it, it, it completely took me out and yeah it was hor absolutely horrible I've never experienced anything like that in my life and I never want to again and then I got it again a couple of weeks ago but this was tame compared to a previous I've still I've, I'm clear but you can still hear it in my voice my throat isn't right I'm coughing lots, but hey, you know, the worst thing about it is I cough so much, I've wrenched my back. Oh, the joys of age. You young ones, you have, youth is wasted on the young. Ha. Right. Okay, that's my rant over. Um, I'm going to be leaving London soon now. I thought, I really thought I was going to be moving to Scotland. And at one stage, it was only a couple of hours away before I signed off on a lovely stone cottage in the countryside. And it just fell through. And I guess the universe has got other plans for me. But I'm going to be leaving London and I'm going to be leaving at the start of April. Um, so I'm taking time off. I haven't had a break of more than a week for about 12 years. So I'm stopping I'm, I'm finishing all the work i've got in that has been paid for uh that will be done by mid late march and then i'm on holiday for a week abroad and then i'm taking march april off to move home i'm starting readings again on the 2nd of may and um, i am plowing through all the emails that people have sent me i'm up to about five or six weeks ago now i will catch up with everyone and i will book everyone in but uh I need time off. Having said that, I'm not starting readings again till the 2nd of May, and then I'll only be doing two or three, two days a week, concentrated, but nevertheless. Having said that, I'm finishing, I'm starting for the final time my beginner's course in astrology this week. You can find out all about it on my teaching website, www astrobabbleproductions.com but this week I'm starting the first module again on the well I'm doing seven sessions the second six will be on the polarities Aries Libra Taurus Scorpio Gemini Sag Cancer Capricorn Leo Aquarius Virgo Pisces the first one is the one I do at the start of every teaching course looking at the genders the modes the elements, the symbols of astrology. It's the basic language of astrology. Uh, there's still about 20, 25 places left on these courses, although the numbers aren't really to worry. It's not, it's not a problem. It's on Zoom. So if you're interested, um, I'll be starting the beginner's module again this Thursday, and there's still places left, providing my voice doesn't get any worse. It's, it's going to be fine. So, um, yeah, all changed for me. I know the world's changing very fast at the moment, but I need to take time off so that when I do come back in May, I'll be at full throttle. So the only thing I'm going to be doing between now and the end of start of May is carrying on with the teaching. So if you want to join in, you're most welcome. And um, in the meantime, I'm going to take time out for me because there's a basic philosophy here that says that how can you help anyone else if you're not in good working order yourself? I will reply to everyone who's emailed me. It might take a bit more time. Catch you later. Bye.